when you were talking, when he got you of pyramids in regions and locations, or are you not? Yes. It is not a physical pyramid. It's a beacon. And like you see that light coming off the top, it, um, it's like a golden beacon pyramid. That, what you see, which you've seen, which they see, those pyramids of light have what you see as a golden beam or light going out the top. Mm. These beams are all over the globe, the planet, in the water, some of them too. What's the mm. purpose of that, those pyramids with beams? Those beams all come up to form a grid around the Earth. Mm. Uh, it's not exactly symmetrical, but it's points that need that energy. And those are all now waking up. Yes. But what's the purpose of, of, those, of the grid? The grid was deactivated a long time ago and a false grid was put in its place. That false grid is now deactivated okay. and coming down. Now, the golden grid, see it like gold, like lines of gold, that grid is being reactivated. And it's not happening at once. It's happening in different regions, different parts of the earth. Some are not even switched on yet or even hoo, 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 hoo. they like a pyramid from the base layer going up. They charge up. They build in strength. So they are all building up or well, not all, but they're building up now. You're, that's what you were talking, Gullis. This is what you are seeing. But it's not. They are small ones, big ones, like powers and principalities. Some areas have much bigger, stronger, advanced structures. Others are smaller. Others, but they are all necessary. They are meant to be where they are. He has seen glimpses of it. Everything is, <laughs> like you say, on the right track. Planned. It's all planning. It's happening. It's right. Okay. So what's the purpose of this light? What is the origin of the light from these pyramids? Changing of the DNA. Changing and, and up, we, it will uplift areas. You will have that sense of light, love. That is important, but more than that, it will be an upgrade. Okay, so it's upgrading our DNA. An upgrade, yes, everything. Everything on is being upgraded, but that was not possible for a long time. There was this dark, see it like a living dark web, like AI type sitting. Okay, but what, what, what created that dark grid or that false grid? Evil intent. Yes. That is what enslaves, what holds down frequencies globally. Specific areas will have light, but it is hard in that, under that grid. Now it'll be much easier, but it is coming, it is coming quickly now, and some areas are turned on. You will notice Ukraine, Russia fighting. Mm. Yes, what's going on there? Not just there, other, but that is a fight for these beacons. Those are areas of prominence. Important. Ukraine sits on a such a pyramid, but a, a, a pivotal, mm, pivotal pyramid. But it is, Yes, for now it is pyramid, but it needs to come. It needs to activate, and it unfortunately it is war is war, but it it it, it was being done 
the activation, even under other presidential candidates, but mm, they resisted, resisted the dark arts forces, evil forces, old evil. Mm. But unfortunately now with war, that is the only way. There will be suffering on both sides. It is not the best way, but it is necessary. But what is the war about? You're saying there's a prominent period. It is not a, about people groups. It is not about the regions hating the people in the regions. This is a byproduct of what sits over that region. And fortunately for the people, for the humans, there will be death of animals, people, nature in this region. But it has got to the point now where it needs to be done what needs to be done. The the death toll is is a necessary evil for the light that needs to come out of that region. That region is sitting on a powerful, powerful uh, beacon. Mm. And the evil will fight with all they have to keep it down. But it will come out. And unfortunately, you will watch news. Humans won't understand it. They will miss direct their hatred, Russia did this, Ukraine this, this, but don't. It's not that you, it's not, it's not about the people uh, killing people in the region. I say again that it is a sadness for having death like this, but you know, even the rebirth after this death serves a purpose, but it is Unfortunate, but from the blood will come life out of the soil. Mm. So you're saying there's a prominent light point yes. for permit. Yes, there. If you look from uh, a higher perspective than space, but looking down on the earth, you will see the grid activating like night lights in the sky, mm. like a spider web around. And over that land, that nation, it is pitch black. The, it's almost as if there's a black hole that is sucking in light there. The web is bending in. Are you talking about in Ukraine? Mm. But didn't you say there was a prominent pyramid there? Yes. So why is it dark? It needs to be uncovered. It needs to be activated. The evil is not wanting to allow that. So they are fighting tooth and nail to hold it. That uh, principality, power, uh, region, okay. but it, it 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 can't be held by them for much longer. It is not possible, but it is necessary now. There was attempts to do it another way, but it has to be done this way. Even the star families mm, and the you can call non-terrestrial, have helped and have done what they can according to their way. Okay. But now it has to go this way. Mm. But it is also a part of the Great Awakening. And why is there such a prominent pyramid, energetic pyramid in this mm -hmm. country specifically in Ukraine? It is just one of the major hubs. There are other very important uh, regions. Okay. But this one is, in that it is very important. Okay. It, it is very important. It is like a, it is like a hubcap of, like we said, the ox wagon wheel. It is the hubcap for that. Region. That region. Okay. Mm. And who are the good guys and the bad guys in this kind of story <laughs> between the two nations? Both you... sides have good and bad. It is not so much about the people, but the 
factions within those people groups that know more. Okay. But how will this physical war actually keep the dark grid in place? How does that work? No, it will it will remove their uh, the, it will remove the dark energetic field that they've been holding in that region okay. so that the so that the pyramid can power up like woo, 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 uh, it has been suppressed, inverted. Okay. Now it is coming up. But how can this physical war actually open up that um, that light? Because you remove those ancient evils that are using dark magic to suppress, that is using technology to suppress, that they are evil. They are, there's no good intent there, and they've, but they are very angry because they are, <laughs> the evil is like a, 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 I don't know what, like a, a animal in a corner that can't run anymore. Its yeah. allies have left in space. They no longer have support from above. The grid is starting to, activate globally globally it is activating the people are feeling it they're rising the energy is rising these hohos are sitting there they they are very angry they because they and now they accuse others of doing what they have been doing for eons they are the evil and who, who is this evil dark evil hot dark it is a mixture of dark energy, non-terrestrial, filthy. Okay. But you're saying it's kind of inevitable for this dark grid it's, to kind of dissolve? It's, it's already dissolving. Okay. It's a matter of time now. But it is. <laughs> I'm laughing because they are wriggly raglies now. They are. It is the the. Uh, the the grid, like a spider's web, is starting to reconnect quicker. Click, 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 click. And it's gold, golden. The black one is perforating like smoke. And that is their connection to, uh, let's say, an even darker evil. But now they are losing that connection. Not only are they losing it, but the light is growing and increasing. So they are like, they are like a creature, like a vampire that is now being exposed to the sun. Okay. Angry, vicious, angry, will do anything. Okay. But why is it specifically Russia that is during, creating this war? There are factions. They have marching orders from Star Alliance. They have marching orders, let's say the, let's say your space family, or let, let's say galactic mm, federation, galactic uh, brothers, whatever you want to call this group. They, they have been prepped. They know, they know Putin has sat with them. Long time. What is what was discussed and agreed upon? They have decided to uh, remove the evil. Okay. They will work together. They, everybody, has a dark past. Some darker than others, but. You, that saying people, tiger spots is not true. People can change. Hearts can change. Are you talking about him specifically? Mm. Where, is he changing or? He changed a while ago. Mm. But he is just one piece in a bigger cog. Everybody will see him as he is the one 
No, it is much bigger plan than just him. He has mm, become the sacrificial lamb. He has agreed to that position. Okay. You know, he's more just an actor in the foreground, isn't he? He is a strong being, but he has, like other strong beings, he has decided, or agreed rather, say, he will... He will take it on his shoulders. A, <laughs> a uh, Christ type sacrifice to say not many people will be able to receive this, but this is what it is. But does a war have to happen for this dark red? Now it must nice. happen. There is no option. Why do you mean there's no option? Can the dark we not just fall? tried before this? There was a lot of, and also, we cannot intervene uh, outside of people have free will and choice. Cannot just come in and boom, now it is better. We have raised them. No, that cannot. We have to allow humans to also make mistakes, go through things. They need to learn, learn from every experience. We did try. We did try to do this in a different way, more than one attempt. It is too late now. So, so it was tried. It, yes, there was a, always. To have a peaceful. Always. Kind of, there will always be the initial. There will always be. Always. Never. <laughs> this is the last, absolute last uh, resort. Okay. Even so, the war could have been far worse. It is also it is a it is war. But it is a small war compared to what it could have been. Okay, but will this war get bigger and kind of spread to the surrounding areas or there is always a possibility of other outlying countries, and yes, there could be still over, but the main focus will not be on those other, it'll just be in, and also very specific regions in this region. Hmm. <laughs> Look underground in this region too. This is, this is where a lot of attention lies. What is going on underground in this region? Yeah, this is where it goes on. The dark heart's attention is there. And the light is, it's like a rat's, or a, yes, a rat's hole or a mole's hole that is being flooded with a hose pipe water. They are cornered and trapped and the light, this golden light is rushing in. Finishing them. But what is going on, like realistically, practically, down there? Old evils. There is experimentation. There is abuse and molestation. There is murder. There is no heart there. There is darkness in there it needs to it needs to be removed but how is is this um, war actually removing that this war is fought on many levels the war that is happening on the ground is an overflow of what is happening at in higher levels of consciousness and spirit Talking about the spiritual war. Mm. But it is hemmed in by your space brothers and sisters. There is uh, you call spirit guides, angelics. On one, you have what you would term demonics. You have this on that side. It all, it's all coming together at one point. This is now Mm. why it has spilled and exploded into the natural. Mm. 
Yes. But it is being fought on many levels. Okay, so are you saying on an energetic or spiritual level that the war is being fought underground as well, or is it more yes, physical? Yes, yes. Physical, physically underground. The people of the world should meditate on love and light for this region. That will strengthen the good force. It will also raise that beacon quicker. Yes, how can people reinforce Send, See the both sides. It's not about the people. See Ukraine, see Russia, see remove judgment, remove remove the this one, that one, remove that. And then focus on the land, focus your heart, see yourself, see this land. In fact, draw pictures of it. Uh, Put a picture in front of you, see it, and then see the people on both sides, see the human race, and then go into your heart and raise up your vibration and your energy and like a beacon, like a laser beam, send it in that direction, send it to that region. Yes. Can, can one visualize the pyramid as well? Yes, I mean, better course. even. See the golden, see it. Encompass the entire land, see it from over it and, and invert it under like the, like the Star of David, you see, like this, do this, hmm, uh, uh, tetrahedron. Yes. Do this, do whatever signs and symbols you need, do them, but the most important is the intent. You see, put love. Love, 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 light, 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 even laughter. <laughs> even laughter. Let's do this. <laughs> what will that do to the area? Uh, <laughs> it makes the dark ones angry, but it is good. <laughs> it strengthens the light. It strengthens. Even now, in saying this, he's realizing he will do this now. He will create a little altar, even for yourself, a sacred space. Do it with intent. Do it with love. And unselfishness is if you would visualize things for yourself, just raise that, but send it there. Yes. Send it there. What is the intent then? Does one send peace or? Yes, any fruit of the spirit, peace, love, light, joy, patience, hope, send these. Yes, okay. Whatever for you is what you feel, send this. We will put it where it needs to be. Think of this. Think of this pyramid. It is. I mean, it is. It is huge. But think of your meditation as a golden brick in this pyramid. Mm -hmm. Every brick helps. Mm -hmm. yeah. Also, when your time here is spent, and you will see what you did at this time, it is beautiful to see the to see what you're building as humans at this time. Keep doing it. Yes. Hmm. Do you have any advice for people in that area who might be feeling fear? Hmm. This is a time of war. The same pyramid, put this over yourself. Put it over your family, over your house, over your car. This will bring light. It is strengthened. It is strong. If you feel that you need to leave this land, leave. If you feel that you need to stay, then you must stay. This is your choice. You will know. Okay. But see the golden light. See it. Move in the opposite spirit of what is happening. Do not fight the tanks. Do not stand in their way. Do not leave this will cause great pain and confusion. Let them do what they are needing to do. When it is done, the people will see with new eyes. Both sides will see. Light will come. And the region will be raised. Okay. And why is a pyramid form so specific? Why is that strong? strong? Why is it, is it stronger than a sphere? We form? use these, oh, as you know, on the earth. It works well here. Mm -hmm. But why, why does it work well? It seems very man-made. Spear is it more. Is, it is a strong shape that holds the frequency. Circle is good, but this 
is the time for the pyramid now. Why is this the time for the pyramid? It is raising vibration. It is specific. The circle encompasses once you raise the vibration with all of the pyramids, you will have a circle around oh, you. Okay. But that grid is a circle. But you need these pyramids to raise the frequency first. Okay. Then you can have, or well, you have the beginnings of this sphere. Mm. Okay. But once the light comes up, you, you, humans will be very different in a few years. It's, it is going to be an incredibly incredible shift. Mm -hmm. An incredibly incredible shift. We're looking mm. forward to that. Okay, is there anything? You are else? living it now. What do you mean? You're living it now. It is getting quicker and quicker and quicker. But certain pockets are holding out because, like Ukraine, they are there's old, the old evils. They are holding out, or a lot of them have garrisoned there from other regions too. Mm. Mm -hmm. But you will have this. You will have this in other nations too, to some degree or other. Look at Canada, mm -hmm. uh, Australia. Mm. What's going on there? This is the same holdout of the same evil. But as you can see, their pockets are getting smaller and smaller. <laughs> <laughs> they are not happy. Okay. But they are. They will fight now. It is at that point now where it needs to come up mm, as, as long as it is not as bad as what it could be. Okay. Okay, so any advice for the people in the world that might be yes. worried about this? Conflict? Do the same. Send love. Mm, send the fruits. Build. See the pyramid over the land. See it over your own land, your families. Wherever you are, build, build, build. Do this mm -hmm. over and over and over the more you do it, the stronger this structure becomes. Okay. Mm. And be a part of this. <laughs> be a part of the change in this world. If you are adding, you add your own unique signature to the development of a region. So if you are meditating and sending your, let's call it your package to that region, your light package, <laughs> you have put an energetic stamp on the region. You have added something that was never there in that region before from an outside. And you also then agree to light and love. You agree to that contract. And the more that stand and send this light and love to the region, whatever it may be in this case, the conflict in Ukraine, then send just do this over and over. You are building it up. And then you see another region, boom, build up. This is what you call spiritual warfare. Build, build, build. I don't think people know how to just send love. What is that technique that's the most effective? People always think things through too much. They <laughs> make it complicated. When you see a child on a, on a slide, they go down. Whee! They are happy. Huh? <laughs> So with this, see, see happy things, see love, see light in the land, see people hugging, see the construction of new buildings, of new whatever was destroyed, see it being replaced with something better, see brothers and sisters, each side of the borders coming together, bless them, send love to them, just do this, it's simple, simple. But I know people struggle with, with visualization. <laughs> they must practice. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. They can write poems. They can write stories. They can anything that you, any intent that you have for this region that is good. Yes. Do. Or create music, maybe. Whatever Correct. is, wherever your strength lies, I suppose, in a creative Correct. sense. Correct. Right. Okay. Even if, yes, is strange. Even if you're a sporty person. <laughs> 
run a lap around a field for the nation. Okay. Mm-hmm. So it's more than intense. This is intense. This is energy being released in a different form, but it is still the energy being released, being released. for this. Yes. Mm. For this unified purpose. Mm. Okay, is there anything else about this conflict? External conflict, mm. it seems more. It should not be too long. I cannot give exact timelines, but either way, it should not be too long. What is the dominant timeline? They are using what the enemy used against them all those years ago. What do you mean? Let's click. Where the enemy swarms in without warning, without, and they come in. The Nazis were good with this. Yeah. Now, this very tactic is being used against them. Against the Ukrainians? Or not the, the people. Okay. The dark the dark. Okay. It is not the people. People, unfortunately, they're suffering. And there is darkness and there is light on both sides. Okay. Hmm. But do the people really have to suffer for this fall? No, but they made this choice. Okay, so this is a collective decision, a collective mm. choice to, in order for the dark to fall in that area. Mm. They did not need to go this way. Okay. What what other uh, routes were, were tr- tried beforehand? This could have been peaceful. This dark, uh, there are so many possibilities. You want to know them all? <laughs> no. I was just wondering what else was attempted before this kind of yes, decision was negotiations, made. even okay. negotiations with the dark heart saying, if you leave, we will give you passage to okay. where uh, on world, off world, we, and then they stalling. Then again, we have spoken. What now? Yes. No. And now then they dig in. Okay. So they don't want to let go of control. No. But why were they ordered to move? Uh, move off planet. What was what happened there? How did that happen? If they dark has also abused children in the sense that they were abused children. Yes. They've done incredible evil, but a lot of that was other evil coming in. Yes. Off world evil, spiritual evil. There is evil, there is good. They are two. So they are held accountable, but they are also given a choice to change. Yeah. It is hard to, if you can, if you are brought up in a system that cannot change, like when he spoke earlier of the camps that he was in and then taken to the moon. The, the, you are in this. You are brought into this. You are not choosing this. Mm-hmm. To choose it is different. But to be born into it is also different. So there is grace. And you are given a choice. They can be taken and rehabilitated, healed, uh, mentally, emotionally, physically. Okay. They have a choice. The majority chose not to take this route. Okay, they didn't want now, to. Now, there is only one solution. It's kind of by force, you're saying? Correct. Okay. Okay, is there anything else about this conflict? Hmm. The sun always comes out after a dark night. I suppose that's a little bit hard to hear if you're in the middle of the dark night. Yes, it is, always. It dark. is. Give you that Jesus walking on the water. You're in a storm. Mm -hmm. But there are greater things on the horizon. Yes. The wheel has to turn now. It has to turn. Mm. So what can people look forward to after this kind of purging? (laughs) The sun. Look. (laughs) at that tarot card of the child on the horse's back. Yes, that's one of the most positive cards in the deck. This is what you look forward to, (laughs) as babes coming out to new life. Yes. Mm -hmm. And you leave the tower 
behind. Yes. Are we in the tower card now? Correct. <laughs> okay. Calamity. Mm, must be removed. It has grown up too long in the wrong way. <laughs> okay. Mm. 